Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. A lot of people ask me how to connect Airtable to NDN. In today's video, I will show you step by step how to connect Airtable to NDN. Let's dive in. You can see here, I have an example project here. I have a test base with sheet number one, some data like first name, last name, gender, country, and age. Now I will connect this Airtable base to NDN. First of all, you need to add a step. I will add a trigger manually when clicking execute workflow then i add an apps call air table right here now you can choose the action you need to use i want to have some data on my records so i will choose get record right here okay first of all you need to connect a credential you choose create a new credential if you don't have for easier we will connect using access token to get this token you come back to your air table you will go to your account right here in the API tab, you will go to Developer Hub. In Developer, you click Personal Access Token. Now you create a token, token name. I will choose N it and connections. Now with the scope, this is very important. You can add the scope right here. You will need to choose the scope that's suitable for your task. Right here, you can see data record dash read. It means you allow this token to read. If you want to do some more complicated tasks, you need to add more scope. Right here, data, record, and write. That means you allow this token to write to your record. Similar with command read, command write, and some base read or base write, but we will need this in this video. I will go to next step is the access. I will allow all resources. Now I will add the base. You can choose all the base or you choose the specific base. I will choose my test base at an example. Okay, now I create a token. Now you have your token right here. You can copy it. Click done. You can go back to your end-to-end -end workflow and you paste the access token right over here. They say that you make sure you enable the following scope is read, write, and schema based read. I will add this also. I will come back to this and I will add this uh, scope also right over here. Okay, save change. Okay, I'm done. I will save this. After you save it, you can close this window. Then the credential to connect with is Airtable Personal Access Token Account. The resource, you click the record. The operation, you can try to search for record first. The base one, I will choose my base is the test. The table, I will choose the sheet one. At the sheet one on my example project right here, you can add some filter if you want. Now I can execute the step. You see here, and then and search for 49 items on my air table. Now I can try to filter out. Let me see the age of 33. I will filter out age 33. Okay, I executed. You can see now the people who have age 23 are filtered out. Okay, basically that is a way you can connect Airtable to NDN. You can do any kind of automation task you want. Like I will try now, I will choose a field. I can choose their name, first name right here. I can filter out this first name. Yeah, you see here. I also can filter out the age if you want. I try right now. You will put right here out the age of 23. You execute it and you got the age of 23. Okay, this is just a simple example, but you can do any kind of automation you want. This basically is a way you can connect Airtable to NDN. I hope you will like my videos. If my videos is helpful for you, please give me a like and a subscribe. Drop a comment below if you want to ask me anything. I will see you in my next videos.